Oh, 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 Sherry's behind us. Yeah. There she is. Hey, Sherry. Oh, she's up there. She's up there. There she is. Um, nice leg room here. This is, this is Coach. Coach tray table. Yes, Coach. Yeah, look at this. I can, I can edit videos now. Yeah, you can edit right there. There's uh, plugs on the side. Oh, Good afternoon from Washington, D.C. We just arrived, traveled from Penn Station, Moynihan Hall, Amtrak. We are here for AwesomeCon. Maria and I have not been to that convention since April of 2018. That's one month before we started this channel, so it never made it. it never made it. <laughs> it never made it. This time it will. This is a great convention. We've been coming here even long before that, and we're excited to be here. We have over a dozen friends joining us, and Great costumes and Rosario Dawson and yeah. here we go. Rosario. Day one. So Maria is Nami from One, one Piece. Piece. Guess who I am? <laughs> wild guesses, wild Guess. guesses. We made it into the holding cell. Hey -o. Here we go. The way we like to do it at these conventions is going a zigzag pattern from one end to the other to get a lay of the land. From the point of this recording, we're a couple of weeks out from Frozen Empire. Can't wait. Hey, how are you? Here we have the local Ghostbuster group here. Oh yeah, there you go. It's a great replica. So these guys are the Chesapeake Ghostbusters. We are friends with the Long Island Ghostbusters, so it's the same group. They do a lot of charity for children. There's a xenomorphic. This is a Fremen still suit from Dune. Here's Neo's costume from Matrix. This is all from the Museum of Science Fiction. Red alert. I need more power. There's a phaser from the original Star Trek series. Tricorder, communicator. Klingon, disruptor. Geordi LaForge's visor from Star Trek The Next Generation. Here's the Book of the Dead from the Mummy. This is the weekend of Mario Day. That's not this day. Arnold Schwarzenegger. I think this is his commando action figure. He used to have this. That's right. It looks like Han Solo has a mustache. I couldn't resist seven dollars. You just bought it? I just bought it now, yes. yeah. And that was purchased from Mortar Deep Traders. Is that a spoiler? <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. We have one of two Tea Turtle booths. These are the originals. The other booth that we'll find later will be the licensed stuff. This is Max Level. Here are all their socials. They make really cool giant computer mats. Mando, RIP Carl Weathers. Audrey 2 plush. It's hilarious. Very excited to see Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Found One Piece Legos. I just got pulled aside by local Channel 7 News here. I guess they're doing a story on Awesome Con, so I got to explain my costume. 
We've been coming here since they've kind of started this convention. I was on DC television. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. If I made the cut. We found all the S words. Are you worthy? Yep. Oh, she's worthy. <laughs> Moon Knight weapon. That's cool. Very nice. These are all foam pistols. I've been looking at this one for a while. I've seen this before at other conventions. Han Solo's original blaster and then his Empire Strikes Back blaster there. Here we have the Khan exclusive. Here's a brief look at the menu. And Maria got the sweatpants, right? Yep. These guys? Yep, I, I did a pre-order be before the con. These are cute. <laughs> yeah, I like it. Yeah. That's funny. I love, I love this movie so much. And this looks fantastic. Ming the Merciless, Max von Cito. Very cool. Shorty, 25 bucks. Kihi Kwan. Oh, it comes with a fedora too. I made a purchase. It's actually Robert Shaw in there. <laughs> T-Turtle license merch. Baymax and some cats. Gonzo. Baby Groot. Gurutama. Yeah. <laughs> he bought some things. What things? Where's the other one? And my Robin Hood and my Mary Ann. And we got an Ashoka and, pin. And we got a free pin. For we'll meet her tomorrow. Very cool. Dune was excellent. Oh, thank you so much. Long live the fighters. It's the chicken bunny, everybody. <laughs> That's not actually what it's called. Chicken bunny is from something called the rising of the shield hero. Over here on the far side, we have Mando Mercs, Rebel Legion, 501st. This convention also has a massive artist alley. What have they got in their vehicles and fake dinosaurs? Sorry, Newman. <laughs> this is a bag? <laughs> this is our MVP right here. Number one video on our channel is unboxing this guy. <laughs> Good job. Thank you. So that's day one of the con, but not the end of this video. This is the entire geek end, if you will. The whole geek end. The whole geek end. It belongs in a museum. Day two, awesome con. We're Star Warsing today. Star Warsing hard. Pretty much wearing what we wore at the Star Cruiser on day one. Yeah, yeah. Except you much. got the full makeup this I time. I did full makeup this time. Uh, Normally on Batsu you can't go full face color, but it was only half. So now, first time doing full face blue. Wearing the Cassian Andor jacket, the Empire Strikes Back Han Solo shirt. I got the Rebel Legion Echo Base lanyard. Long live the fighters. That's Dune. Yeah. <laughs> Long live the fighters. And my brand new Falcon ring. And the rest of our Star Wars gang. Yup nub. Yup nub. I want to call that. Star Wars. Much larger turnout for Saturdays. Saturdays, everyone has their A-game cosplay as well. First order of business, we have a photo opportunity with Rosario Dawson. Our group is 11 a.m. It's 11, about 11.10 oh, 11, a.m. We have to line up at 11.10 a.m. for our group. And we're probably gonna have like literally five seconds with her. <laughs> Hello, well, be a cool five say seconds. cheese and say goodbye and that's it. <laughs> there we go, we just met Rosario Dawson in five seconds or less. She was like, oh yeah, well, she, she loved my outfit. Yeah, she loved the Maria's outfit. They have a build your own saber here. Just like Galaxy's Edge. Yeah, it's like a Sabi's workshop. There's been a couple of these vendors here. This booth right here is the Legging Glass. TheLeggingGlass.com It's a skirt, it's right? It's got pockets. It's got pockets. It's got po skirts with pockets. Skirts with pockets, man. It's a win-win. Heading into the main stage for the Charlie Cox panel. That's Daredevil, if you don't know. Welcome to the stage, Mr. Charlie Cox! Which characters from Marvel can be from the comics, can be from the MCU? Which characters do you think are 
you most want Matt Murdock to interact with? All of them. <laughs> <laughs> Great question. I have to be really careful here because anything I say, when it's reported, <laughs> it's reported like it's the word of God <laughs> spoken. <laughs> And, I, and so I have to be careful. You know, look, I, I love all those, everything those guys have been doing. Um, and there's a, few, there's a few characters that I would love to have some interaction with. Um, a lot of them are, are obvious. <laughs> um, but I, I have no idea if they, what those, if they have any of those plans for me or not. But, but I'm, I'm in the door now, at least. You know what I mean? Like, I'm in the room, Woo! so... <laughs> There he is, Charlie Cox, $26.99. <laughs> Decided to get the Temple of Doom Indiana Jones action figure and then try to contain myself and not buy <laughs> short round as well. I would like to get him, it's just the money is, uh, I, got, I need dinner money. <laughs> oh man. Thank you guys. They're donating to City Dogs and City Kitties Rescue. It's Pillow Pascal. Pillow Pascal. For $30. This right here is the Aliens fan group, United States Colonial Marines. Worlds are colliding. We are all pretty much scattered today. <laughs> There's a lot of There's us. There's a so dozen of us, but expected. we're everywhere. Yeah. Scattered, but we're getting together right now for a group photo. <laughs> Take a bunch. We got, we got a bunch. Rapid fire. Yeah. Lots of good smiles. Good points. Good points. That was day two. Let's go over to day three of three. It's me, Mario. Sherry and I are cross-playing today from Star Rail, which is a game. It's a mobile game. game. Yeah. Wen Afin and Sushang. We should have something to eat. And a line. And we have a line. Danielle is representing Mario Day as Wario. <laughs> That's so good. This is the third and final day of the event. Not that crowded on a Sunday here. The event will return next year, I believe, in April of 2025. Don't forget to like, follow, and share. $80, this is a mystery box, no idea what the heck's in it. Faith and Rob made the investment. <laughs> On this installment, uh, Faith makes terrible financial decisions. <laughs> What's in the box? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> oh! Yeah! You want a PlayStation 5? Oh, yes. Well, let's go uh, back. Yes. Wait, I have to open the rest of the box. Okay, wait. Oh, wow. Who cares about? Who cares what else is in there? Oh my God. Wow. I guess that was a good deal. Yeah. yeah. How much was the box? Eighty, 80 bucks. bucks. Yeah. I knew it had a good vibe to it. Oh, you got a ray in there. You got a Joker. Weird Al's book. Oh yeah. Awesome. I'm gonna put this in my pocket. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. Congratulations.
That's gonna wrap up Awesome Con 2024 here in Washington, D.C. It's always a very well-run convention, so if you are in the area of Washington, D.C., we highly recommend to come visit this con. We will see you real soon, and may the Geek Ends be with you. See you in the next video, guys. That's us. And hey, that looks like me. So in business class, we get a curtain. A little bit more room. There we go. For the rest. Back to reality. <laughs> Just for a little bit. For a little bit.